Some serious elbow grease is going to be required in today's video. Elite Series 71, Jeff Hardy, I'm putting all the blame on you. They threw this in there. They said, Hero Fakes, we got some tasks for you. We have some missions. Are you up to it? Come on, dude. You're going to bring it to me? We're going to make it happen. I ain't going to fart around with this one because this is the pink that actually matches the actual figure itself. But these two right here, as you guys, as we talked about it in the review, I was going to make these two tires possible. Now, the first one, I know we semi-covered it. We aren't going to have all that much to do with this one because this is going to be swapping out the arms. And I will still have to transfer those basic hands. I don't know if these ones will work. If anybody has done it, please let me know. I'm going to go ahead and attempt it still so that way we can still keep the tattoo work. But the arms, I'm actually going to get those from a fantasy metal figure that they had made. And no, Hero Figs didn't make it. It's not a custom. But Balor, you never wore it. Not on live TV at least. This shirt right here. I need the sleeves off this. Now since it is fantasy, I really don't mind messing around with this. And actually, I had this one, you guys. We had made a uh, custom Finn Balor Demon. And these were kind of the parts left over from it. So I think I'm going to bring a little bit more to this basic. And it is suffering right here from the swiveled, like the extra loose arm. So hopefully, I, I don't think it'll fix it. Because obviously, we're not changing anything at the peg. It's going to be these black sleeves that I'll need onto this Elite to make this current look right here. Well, not current. But that first appearance that he had brought back when he had that face paint. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and put these sleeves onto the basic. Because this, this is nothing but parts. So you'll get a little something extra out of the basic. For this next one, you guys, this is going to be more of a two-part process. The painting, it's going to have to be required. I'm not going to take any shortcuts on this one. Because this is my favorite one out of the three. So I want to go a little bit above and beyond for you. Uh, the Fiend. As you guys saw, we've done the custom, the lantern, it's in the process, it's in the works. So one thing that I wanted to do when I get into the actual painting of it all, that's where we're going to wrap it up. So what I'm going to use, I'm going to use this one, which is the red, white, and blue. It's going to be the chase figure. I'm not using the actual arms from it. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of those, pop those off. We're going to torso crack the basic, and we're going to put these purple arms right here onto the Elite. So you'll see how, like, the actual the skin tone that, that we'll have to do up front, because it'll be rips. It'll be rips up front, and it'll be uh, rips in back. Turn on that notification. You guys are going to want to miss that. Ali, this is a whole mess of fix. This is going to get confusing real quick, but I'm going to make it as simple as simple can be. You guys saw my hunt. We found one of these for dirt. Seven dollars cheap, super cheap. You can't find elites for that, but you can't even find basics for that price. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and get the basic from series 101, which is the rescaled version of the Ali head scan. Not rescaled, but shaved down to fit better onto the actual figure. I'm gonna use the head scan right here onto one of the yellow ones, which means that'll leave me with an extra head of one of the of the yellow attire. So what I'm gonna do, that yellow one right there, it's still gonna be utilized, man. I'm gonna leave the red one as it is. Love the red one. I still wish I actually, um, one thing I might do, I might pick up the chase variant of the basic so we can also update the smaller scale on the red figure so we'll use that one the remaining head scan from the yellow and we'll pop it onto that purple one because i had to put it back dude i was fighting because this was all prior to me finding that second one so ali you're gonna get your head scan right there it's gonna be resized adam cole right here you guys already know man come on we have to try it it's a different attire it's a different look and this part the part that i'm gonna cover right now it won't be part of the fix-up i don't know why mattel thank you for pointing that out you guys i don't know why mattel gave us the armband right here on the left side like they must have just gotten on the wrong side of the bed man they're like man was it the left or was it the right that adam cole had come on man how long you been looking how long have you been watching nxt to know that you should have put it on the correct dart all right that's not the fix up hero fix tell the people what they came here to see the head scan i want to put that head scan right here from the brand new series elite series 71 onto the three pack right there or it's american title we can play around with it for those people that were wondering i had several people hit me up on this what did i use for the constable or for baron corbin for the tank top check this out it's actually baron corbin again this isn't a fix-up i just want to answer because you guys do tend to ask um like anytime that we do updates and i never get a chance to recap it right here on the custom fix-up videos it's the baron corbin shirt it's the original tank top mold had to get rid of the white one he changed the look he kind of went back to square one but without a logo so i just turned it inside out and there you go now when you get the basic when the basic finally does drop it'll be a simple fix-up for just about everybody because the formula that never changed that's still very much the Shawn michael lower legs with the up or uh, yes the baron corbin elite from the waist up now big show last one actually let's cover this john cena because the cena when he had made a return when he came out and he tried bringing back like the old thug life 
this is the hair that he had. Yes, the look of the shirt, it was it was more of a baseball tee versus like this one that you're seeing with the tank top. So this is going to almost tie in with that look, but it's going to be fantasy where he brought back the old dad hair with the young John Cena. My friend Big Show, we can't forget about Big Show because like Mattel, when they put this out, I was very happy that we were going to see a release of Big Show from this current era. But the thing that kind of put me down, it didn't put me down. I mean, it's great because then I had that also that other attire from this time frame. But I was kind of wishing and hoping that we got the solid trunks, kind of like what you saw with my custom. So this is going to be an update right here on the custom. We're going to go ahead and use the brand new ponytail look from the Mattel, because mine, it's absolute trash, man. Look at that. I Like, how is it even? Gravity is, like, fighting it, right? This figure right here, it makes no sense. How <laughs> the ponytail, it's flaring out. Like, he's not even dropping a choke slam on anybody for that to make sense. So it'll be nice to have the Mattel look right here onto my custom. All right, guys, let's get to it. It don't always work, but you know what? You have to find a different route, and that's what we had to do for at least one of them. Biggest thing was that the hands, yeah, we tried it from the basic, but there was a huge gap where the actual wrists meets the forearm. So I just, I had to try the ones that actually came with Elite Series 71. One thing, one of two things I could go about doing to fix the issue. One, I could repaint this one, because I mean, we got two different hands to use for that actual one that came with it with an all pink look. Or what I could do, since this one didn't work, I still have that, you guys remember that leftover Jeff Hardy that we had from that tie-dye look? Well, here it is. I think underneath all this blue and white, I think if I acetone this, I think it's a solid black. So if I end up doing that, you guys, that'll be a simple fix, man. Just swap it at the shoulder. But all that aside, you guys, check it out. Now we have the all-black look, the way that he had it during that promo when he was talking about bringing back that new, or the old look, back into the, just to kind of bring up his stats because the whole Hardy situation, the Team Hardy, Team Extreme, it wasn't working. So I like it. How do you guys feel about it? That Jeff Hardy, it's doing quite a bit for me. This next one. It worked beautifully. The shoulders, they popped in there. But the thing is, anybody that has ever torso cracked the basic, you know, there's no turning back. So this one, I mean, I could still mess around with it. Maybe put those blue arms that we saw with the Elite. But it, it's never going to be the same way that it used to be. So, But that's not what I wanted from it. I wanted this. I wanted the purple. So I am going to have to repaint that blue. I'm going to give it that same matching color. So when, like I said, when we do the updated look, you'll see what I'm talking about with the skin tone right there on the tights. Love it, you guys. I know it's kind of hard to see what it should be looking like, but that's the way that we should have gotten it. So here, now we got both of those two Jeff Hardys. The two head scans right there, we got all those taken care of. Adam Cole, let me show you. Where's the other one, man? It's buried underneath. Big Show, you trying to eat him, bro? All right, here it is. Uh, it's a little bit wobbly, I am going to tell you that. I mean, I might have to modify the actual peg insert, but the head scan right here onto uh, the old Elite, it still works pretty good. And then you got the newer look right here with the corrected armband. This one, again, this one is from MAC decals, but I like both, man. I'm digging both. I like that North. I like, I don't know what it is about this belt, you guys, but this North American title, it looks so damn good with that head scan combination right there. Let's put Adam Cole. John Cena, how do you feel about your new look? Hero fix, I hate you. <laughs> he probably does, man. Oh, Cena, Cena, Cena. Br old man trying to bring back what was something good? Did he? Ah, everybody loved it when he brought back Thug Life. This is the the look that he had. Again, keep in mind the shirt, custom figure shirts. I know he had made one. So if you ever do want to reflect that with Elite Series uh, 71 right here, you can definitely do so. Check that out, man. How do you guys like this one? I don't know what I'm doing with this. I just wanted to show you the leftover. But there's John Cena, old man Cena, trying to be cool right there with the high school kids. Second to last gem of it all, the ultimate Ali collection is it not hero fakes you're still missing the chase basic don't worry man it'll happen just give it time bro we're trying to make things happen for the whf universe and you got ali trying to bash i mean come on dude all right so there's the head scan from the elite from the yellow attire i don't know why i'm showing you this i just love seeing all four of them together dude i'm a big fan of ali and i am a big 
big fan of the rescaled look right here with this one. Check it out. This is, let me take off the vest so you can see the overall proportions of how the torso looks because that's when you're going to really notice the significant differences from Series 101 right there. Check it out. So the shaved sides, I mean, the, not only did he go to the barber shop, he went right there to WHF Playground and he says, Hero Fix, you want to play today? Let's do it. <laughs> Big Show, get over here. All right, here's the Big Show. Where's the leftover? Here it is. Here's the Jax. This, I ain't hating. I'm actually still like liking this, the Mattel or the Jax head scan. Because if you guys uh, do recall, the biggest gripe of this head scan was the way that it sat on the body. But when you put the shirt on it, it kind of takes away from the elongated giraffe looking ass look. Look at that. <laughs> There it is. It's got a slight cut right there. You see it right up top. So now having it on there, it, it still looks pretty bad. Get I'm, I don't like it. I, but I do like this. The look, the debut of the big show, the gyro custom figgy ponytail. I'm telling you, we accomplished so much. We got the big show that hero fakes. Like if I had any request or say as to which like specific look that I was looking for him right there, trunks, ponytail look, John old man, Cena, long hair, dad hair, Jeff Hardy got old 2009, got the rebirth right there of the charismatic enigma. Adam Cole right here with that new, oh dude, I love it. I, that belt, I'm actually, the, the thing that I'm doing, we'll talk about it some other time. Let me know how you guys feel about it. Which one was your favorite? Do you guys like the new Ali hat skin? Are you glad that they resized it? Are you happy to see Big Show back in the line? Dude, anytime you get a giant, I don't care if it's the Big Show. One day I do hope that we get Giant Gonzalez. Drop a like, man. That one would be like the ultimate right there to complete the Giants. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And we'll see you on the next one.